Young at Heart by Pam Young I'm glad I'm not a movie star. I woke up this morning after an especially busy night. I dreamed I bought a raffle ticket and I won the main prize. It was a job parking cars at my dentist's office. I've never heard of raffling off a job for the prize, but in the dream I was very excited I'd won. As dreams go, they never make sense. My dentist doesn't need a car parker. He's right next door to Safeway. The sun was peeking over the mountains enough to cast my shadow on our bedroom door as I headed to the kitchen where Terry was making coffee. The shadow alarmed me because it looked like some kind of human rooster. Then two seconds later, Terry laughed and pointed to my head. I know, I know, I just saw my shadow, I said in a defensive tone. (laughs) You look like Barry Manilow, he chuckled as he went for his camera. I let him take a few pictures of me, which you can see if you listen to the blog on my website. And those of you who are listening can see them as I read. I wondered as I looked at the photos if the state of one's hair on any given morning has a direct correlation with the dreams or nightmares one has. I also wondered what Angelina Jolie or Laura Linney looked like in the morning after an especially busy night like I'd had. I wonder if they've ever won a job in their dreams. Terry and I always have coffee by our fireplace in the morning where we plan our day and he reads from a book, The Awakening. It's a day book and the words for today had to do with being honest on the outside so your relationships can grow. With the combination of the rich, hot coffee and business discussion, by the time he was reading the book, I'd totally forgotten about how my hair looked. After breakfast, I went to shower and dress, and that's when I saw myself in the mirror. The first thought that came to my mind was, I'm glad I'm not dating. I not only looked like Barry Manilow, I looked like I'd just come back from shock treatment like in One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. My second thought was, I am so glad I'm not a movie star. Bless them all. Laura Linney can never go out into her yard in the morning because there could always be a paparazzi hanging from a tree ready to snap a shot that just might look like Barry. I wonder what Barry Manilow looks like in the morning. Maybe he looks like me. I dare you to share a morning shot with me. Come on, it'll be fun. Well, we start off this week with a correction. We missed that the second week in March is National Bubble Week. I apologize for that. The 28th is called Something on a Stick Day. The 29th is National Mom and Pop Business Owners Day to honor all the small businesses who serve us. Show your support and shop at them today and every day. The 30th is I Am In Control Day. Take a deep breath relax and decide something to be in control of. It's also take a walk in the park day. And of course, Saturday is April Fool's Day. Not Sunday is. Gotcha. If you want to learn more about these holidays, go to holidayinsights.com. <laughs>